Today, there were 472 new confirmed positive COVID-19 cases in the county of Los Angeles, bringing our total number of cases to 10,496, a 4% increase since yesterday. For comparison, the past seven days had seen an average daily increase of 437 new cases. In the city, there were 245 new cases today, bringing the total to 4,707, a 5.5% increase since yesterday. And most tragically, of course, we learned today of 42 new deaths. This is 42 new Angelinos who lost their life because of COVID-19. It brings the total to 402, a 12% increase since yesterday, and unfortunately the highest number of deaths that we have had to face. We know that blood testing is critical in looking at immunity, helping identify Americans who might be able to serve in workplaces or classrooms, and roles that may otherwise create significant risk of transmission in the days ahead. The existing tests are still not good enough and not widespread enough. We need a better ability to measure antibodies and understand and test results translate into actual, how test results might translate into actual immunity. And blood tests might give us critical information like who might have plasma that can help guide our research and protect more people and save more patients. And so tonight we're, we're very proud to highlight a partnership between the County Department of Public Health, my office, USC, and Lieberman Research Worldwide in Century City. City as well as collaborators at UCLA and Stanford to address serology and the tests that will measure antibodies in the blood, tests that will help us move from crisis to recovery and to see how many people, in fact, are infected or have been infected with this novel coronavirus. This partnership will accelerate research and development and help us answer questions that are key to what you want to hear. When, Mayor, are we going to get back to normal?